Well, we've seen a move of the week come out of the FIDE World Cup in Baku, but unfortunately with good moves also come blunders from time to time. Robert, in this position, Ding Li Ren, who I think for many people was China's favorite to, to go farther than anybody, despite Wei Yi being the super young talent, well, he just blundered away the position. He played the move queen to e7, which allows a queen trade into a completely lost endgame. What do you think, Robert? Was it nerves that White didn't just play queen takes g5 and, and head for probably an easy draw, or was it maybe something else? Yeah, I think it had to be nerves, Danny, because White didn't even need to win this game. If he had drawn, he would have gone the next series of tie breaks. But instead, he makes a really horrible blunder queen e7, whereas queen takes g5, sure, temporarily you're down a pawn, but with that pass pawn on d6, you have no realistic chance of losing the end game, especially because the weak is on a6. So it seemed like a bad case of maybe nerves mixed with time trouble, and down goes Ding Li Ren to Wei Yi, the superstar. Yeah, no, it's a great point and an excellent breakdown there. For those wondering, well, why is queen e7 so much worse than queen takes g5? Well, queen e7 makes it a lot easier for black to go gobble up that pass pawn. White just walked right into a position where now black can gobble up the f6 pawn before white has any chances to push it. After bishop e8, the king comes to f6, and winning the a6 pawn is not enough because the b5 pawn is so easily protected. So uh, Mr. Wei Yi went on to win the game quickly. As you can see from the line here, the Black King gets active, the B-pawn falls, and that was all she wrote. What do we expect here of the uh, youngster Wei Yi as he, as he moves further on in his career? A challenger for Carlson, Robert? I mean, it's possible. Unfortunately for him, he got knocked out in the World Cup by Peter Svidler, so he's not moving on yet to face Carlson. But I think in the years to come, you'll see him be the top, one of the top challengers, the very minimum. Yeah, absolutely.